South Florida seeing another day of storms mixed in with some strong winds. And parts of Miami-Dade and Broward remain under a flood watch tonight. Our chief certified meteorologist Betty Davis is here with how long the wet and windy weather will be around. Betty. The rain's going to be off and on for the next several days. Even tonight, we're seeing a few more showers running back in at us. They're running in off the Atlantic waters. In some cases, they're spotty. And then in other cases, we're noticing almost a banding type feature. Here's one band running in, stretching from about Key Biscayne on down toward Homestead and then back toward the Everglades. Then we're also looking at some spotty showers coming in around the Keys as well. And and as mentioned, there is more rain to come. We're simply going to add to what we have seen over the past couple days. When you add the couple inches we got today to what we have seen since the start of the work week, well, it's totaling anywhere from uh, three to five inches. Some isolated spots, as you'll note by Doppler radar estimates, have seen a bit more than that. There's one spot of seven inches not too far away from Opalaka. Bottom line, flood watch in effect through Wednesday evening. The ground is saturated, more heavy rain possible. That could lead to some flooding out there tomorrow. There will be a concern for that. And it still is on the breezy side tonight. We'll carry the breezes into tomorrow, although tomorrow may not be quite as breezy as it was today. The rain chance is high for the middle part of the week. The possibility for rain overnight into Wednesday, 